I spent one hour each day creating a Geometry Dash level. Here's how it turned out. Please subscribe, my computer blue screened while making this. I wanted to have a place where you could fall down on the floor and still jump. I added this area where you teleport upwards and the colors change. I went for purple and green with this part and added these cool triangles to the sides. I made sure to move the shadows to a different layer. And then, um, uh, I, I maybe copy and paste them. This is how the block design looks so far. Pretty nice. Hey, they kind of remind me of buildings. For these blocks in the air, I didn't want to add full shadows, so I just added 3D outlines. I put the 3D designs on the wrong side, so I just made sure to rotate them. After a while, these boxes were done. I also wanted to add some glow to these blocks to make them look less boring. Instead of adding green triangles to the green blocks, because uh, that, that, that was just not very smart, because you can't even see those, I added purple triangles to the green blocks. Made sure to set them to one, and just started adding them. I also added triangles to these big top blocks here. And I made sure to set that one back to green. Now time for the ground spikes. It was now time to work on the custom ground. Ground again had a dark purple theme. I am again adding that custom E to this part. I wanted to make the ground style similar to the block design I used on the last part. Move it down, set it to the opposite color, scale it up to 1.05, and how does that look? I'm gonna add some glow under this green part just to make it look a little better. I feel like I want to add some more deco to this ground. I might also add some glows beneath these just to make them pop out more. When in doubt what to do, just use glow. I feel like here might be a good time to put my first user coin. I'm not sure where yet, but... Oh yeah, I forgot. I also need spikes. I'm gonna take those two and I'm gonna make them... One. Oh, no. Well, that does not work. Uh, one and also detail one. There we go. Oh yeah, jump indicators. Everyone loves those. What did I use for indicators in the first section, actually? I'm adding some more of these basic saw blades because I do not know what to do. I'm gonna stuff one down here. And done. The timer's up. Subscribe.